with a lot of us working from home right now, you may run into some home networking challenges. Maybe you're sitting far away from your router, or maybe you, um, you have limited bandwidth on your home internet service provider. One thing you can do to kind of help the quality of the audio within your team's meetings is to turn off the incoming video. So if you have a pane here and you got four or more people all using their video like, like they hopefully are, um, it's nice to see their face, but if you notice that their audio starts to kind of chop out, starts to have trouble understanding what they're saying, you can click down here at the bottom, more actions in the control bar. If you click on that inside of Microsoft Teams, you can click turn off incoming video. If I turn that off, now I just see Spencer's badge photo instead of his live video. And you'll notice that a lot of times if your audio starts to degrade, turn off that incoming video, the audio quality will go way up again and you'll be able to hear them more clearly. If I wanna see Spencer's face live again, I just click more actions again right there, and I click turn on incoming video, and then there's Spencer's live uh, webcam footage as well. So that's a quick tip to hopefully um, help your network bandwidth a little bit at your own house. I would still recommend being able to see each other. I would recommend turning on your video in general, but if you're having trouble um, understanding what people are saying, Try turning off that incoming video before you turn off your own webcam video. See if that helps you out.